Hello and welcome to Business 360. I'm Archana Solanki and here are the headlines this hour. Stock markets end range-bound session with marginal losses. Bank stocks buck the trend. The rupee continues to gain ground against the dollar after depreciating 10% in 2022. The world is perilously close to a recession, says the World Bank, hands a sharp cut to its global growth forecast in 2023. From 3% earlier to 1.7%, expects India's GDP growth to slow to 6.9% in FY23 and projects a 6.6% growth rate for FY24. Oil prices fall amidst an unexpected build-up in the U.S. inventory as public sector oil marketing companies hope for a 50,000 crore cash compensation from government in FY23 on fuel price freeze. That's an exclusive. Electric vehicles hog the limelight as the auto expo returns after three years. Maruti Suzuki unveils its electric SUV concept set to hit the market in 2025. Tata Motors to launch a slew of electric vehicles, Hyundai and Kia. Also show off their EVs, 75 models set to be showcased by 48 automakers in attendance. NRIs without an Indian mobile number may soon be able to use UPI for transactions as well. The MPCI asked companies to ensure the system is ready by April. The facility will initially be rolled out for NRIs in 10 countries including the US, UK, Saudi Arabia, UAE and Australia. The Supreme Court agrees to hear Google's plea against the competition regulator's 1,337 crore rupee penalty order after NCLAT refused an interim say. The regulator had fined Google for abusing its dominant market position in the Android phone market. The company Law Appellate Tribunal also turned down another petition by Google challenging a separate CCI order. Relief for Johnson & Johnson, the Bombay High Court cautions Maharashtra drug regulators' order suspending the company's license to manufacture baby powder. The High Court calls the state action arbitrary and unreasonable. Angry protesters halt the demolition of two hotels marked unsafe in Uttarakhand's Joshi Mutt. Chief Minister promises 1.5 lakh rupees as aid to affected families who are being moved to safer locations. Footwear makers bat for lower duties on raw materials, production linked incentives, interest subvention, among others. This upcoming budget, CNBC TV 18, gets you the industry wish list from the country's footwear manufacturing hub, Agra. And big honor for RRR at the Golden Globe Awards, music director M.M. Kareem emerges victorious in the best original song category ahead of Lady Gaga, Taylor Swift. And Rihanna, the film, however, lost out to Argentina 1985 in the non-English film category. All right, let's start with the action from the last street. Range-bound session 